Hey guys, so the other day I had a flat on my bicycle and the wheels of my bike come with these Presta valves. And how to fill air into these valves isn't quite intuitive, so in this video I want to explain to you how to do this. So after removing the dust cover, you're going to find this nut here on the top and uh, you are going to see that you can unscrew this a little bit. You won't be able to take it off completely, but you can unscrew it a little bit and then as soon as you do that, when you press on top of the valve, it's going to leak a little bit of air. And pretty soon you're going to find out that your conventional pump is not going to fit onto these valves. So what you need is one of these valve adapters and these go from Presta valve to the Schrader valve. So the Schrader is the standard valve that you usually have with your car. So this is usually what the end of your pump looks like and this is just not going to fit onto the Presta valve. So all we have to do now is unscrew the nut on top of the valve just a little bit. And then we take the adapter and we're going to screw this on top of the valve. Just screw it on just, just a little bit. It doesn't have to be screwed on very much. And then we're going to take here our standard pump. We're going to put this on here. And then don't forget to pull down, push down this lever here. See like this, just to tighten it, to make it secure. So now it stays on the uh, adapter. And at this point we can now turn on our pump. So here I have like this electrical pump. And uh, we can use this, this goes really fast, but if you have like a manual pump, it works the same way. And just, I just find this a little bit more convenient, I have this pump around all the time. So we're going to run this a little for a little while. And so this is here a mountain bike tire, so this needs uh, between 20 and, or 22 and 30 PSI. Uh, don't mind the uh, display on my pump, this is completely wrong, this doesn't really work that well anymore. So I can't trust this. Don't trust the number here, so I'm not actually going up to 44 PSI here. Uh, just let it run for a while. If you have a pressure gauge, check it. You can also just rely on your on your gut feeling and just by squeezing the tire with your fingers. And then once you think you have enough air in the tire, just turn off your pump. And then we uh, disconnect the uh, hose again, just by pulling up the lever again to uh, loosen it. So let's push it upwards then remove the hose. The next thing, unscrew the adapter. And then also don't forget to tighten that small nut on top of the Presta valve. Now in case you do have the feeling that there's too much air, too much pressure inside of your tire, then unscrew this uh, nut again a little bit and then push on top from on top of the valve. So this will release some air and then you can uh, reduce the pressure that way. And then when you have the right pressure, just tighten that not on top of the valve again and uh, so then the last step is to put that dust cover back on let's screw this on so it does no uh, there's no dirt getting in there and then you're already done okay so i hope you found this video helpful if you have any more questions then please leave a message below